Uh, it's not for the math. Easy. So we're going to discuss something not really math related, but this is uh, pretty useful. Anyway, basically, I'm going to debunk the myth that, uh, well, you asked the question, but it's, can cold weather make you sick? And uh, basically look at weather versus the flu and common cold. You can read more about this on uh, about.com here. I have the link here. You click it up. Uh, but basically, uh, the simple answer, well, is no. Yeah, I just wrote it down here. So this is no this does not make you sick this is just a myth your mom or grandma has been probably been telling you but it's all a lie now if cold weather doesn't make you sick well what does uh, well basically uh the reason you get you you get the flu or the common cold is the flu is caused by the influenza virus uh, i'll explain that later but anyways and then the common cold caused by many different viruses but both uh this is spelled wrong this is s uh e uh, anyways, uh, basically this is caused, well I'll just fix that one there, so basically what this is saying is it's caused by viruses, not weather, so you have to catch these viruses to get sick. Now before I explain why, um, why there's even a connection between weather and, and the cold, well let's just see how they're spread first. Well, it's spread by transfer of the virus, and the flu is transferred by droplets from the mouth and nose, i.e. sneezing or coughing. And then if you touch something with the virus, if you sneeze on something and then someone touched that and, and then they touch their eye, hand, or mouth, or open wound, etc., that's likely causes the infection here. And also inhaling air containing virus from a sneeze when someone sneezes, so just be careful of that. So now you're asking, well, if the cold doesn't cause the, uh, cause the virus, uh, cause you to get sick, then why is there even a connection? Why do people say it? Well, basically uh, the connection in the first place, flu season coincides with winter. So more people get sick in the winter, and the reason is because during winter, like here, the weather is colder and people stay indoors more often. So when you stay indoors more often, you're likely more, yeah, you have more contact with other, other people, thus in increased likelihood of catching the virus. If you're not around people, like when it's warm, you're usually outside and there isn't people sneezing in your face. You're not going to get sick that way, but so that's why when you're inside, you're more contact with people, you're closer in the vicinity, so increased chance of getting sick, and more people do get sick. And also, more people are in school, because school just started. Uh, it's usually people go to school during the winter, during September and whatnot, and then uh, you have more contact with people, etc., likelihood increases of getting sick. And also, research suggests that viruses spread more easily through dry air, and when it's cold, the air is drier outside, but also indoors. You, you, you usually turn your heat on in the house or wherever you're at school and then the air is usually drier as well so then when someone sneezes it can travel a farther distance and you could probably catch a virus like that instead. So now that I've gone through uh, why people connect basically getting cold with the weather also just and also why that it's, it's just connected so you get sick by virus not the weather and now I just want to have some take home points basically cold weather does uh, does not but for to make it write that I just corrected that. So basically, cold weather does not make you sick. Transfer of viruses makes one sick. And also, uh, you should guard yourself from germs and washing your hands often, especially when you're around people. And especially when you're in school and stuff, someone sneezes, uh, just make sure you're washing your hands before you touch your face or anything like that. Well, uh, that's all for it. I just wanted to get through this video because a lot of people would bring up, uh, uh, especially my mom would tell me, don't go outside because you get sick. And I have to explain to her every time. That it does not make you sick. But anyways, uh, hopefully you learned about this one. Uh, hopefully, yeah, you, now you understand why you why you get sick when it's cold. It's not the cold. It's just you're closer to people usually. Well, it's all for you. You can download these notes. You can read more about this uh, at the, the about.com website here on uh, this link here. And that's uh, all for you. You can download these notes and Dropbox link below. And uh, stay tuned for another math easy solution.